Welcome to Daily Rosary Meditations with Dr. Mike Scherslick, where you learn how to meditate and establish a daily habit of prayer while discovering the truths of the Catholic faith. Is there someone you know that could benefit from daily prayer? Share this meditation with them. Welcome to our Daily Rosary Meditation. Let's begin in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let's call to mind all those we've promised to pray for. Hope and youth are concepts closely connected. Every time a speaker addresses a graduating class, they'll probably say something about their bright, hopeful, young faces. Why? What do hope and youth have to do with each other? It's pretty simple, really. Hope is connected with youth because each young person, each person who isn't fully grown, hasn't yet tasted the fullness of human life they can very reasonably hope that the best is yet to come. That's why the theological virtue of hope really is the secret to eternal youth, because no matter how difficult or joyous this life has been, the Christian can look forward toward heaven and say, the best is really yet to come. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. Hope is the antidote to cynicism and a pessimistic view of life in this world. One danger of reading or listening to the news is that we begin to see the world and other people as bad and we become cynical. The attitude that everyone acts from selfishness and that everything is broken, so what's the use? And cynicism sees self-centeredness underneath all charity. It sees pain and boredom as being the conclusion of all joy, and it sees the pointlessness of death at the end of all human life. But Christian hope rejects that. It resists the pull to pessimism, to gloominess, to the lie that the true story is always the ugly one. Sure, there is death and selfishness and pain. Those are part of the human experience. But, but behind all of it, 
And at the end of all of it, for those who want it, are joy and love and the good God waiting for us. The Christian view of reality is not pessimistic. The Christian view of reality is this, and pay close attention. A good God created a good world, and he made you very good, and he's guiding everything to a good conclusion. That is the hope in which we live. That is the correct view of reality, and that should inform our life. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. Nostalgia is another attitude which threatens to rob us of a proper Christian cheerfulness. Hope is the virtue of youth. Nostalgia is the vice of decrepitude. Hope says the best is yet to come. Nostalgia says that the best is behind us. But of course, if we're honest, we know the past wasn't perfect. That's why we were always so impatient for whatever was next, why we constantly fantasized about what we hoped our life would be like, because it wasn't perfect the way it was. Part of the proof that we were made for heaven and that this life isn't it is that when we're young, we eager, eagerly look forward to the future, and when we're older, we pine for the past. Nostalgia shows us that we long for a perfect life, but there's no sense for looking for it in the past. We've already looked there, and it wasn't there. Heaven isn't found on earth, not in any physical place, and not at any moment in time. Heaven is waiting for us beyond all this, and it's going to be greater than you can imagine. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, <laughs> save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. One thing that makes it harder, especially for older people, to let go of the past is that they worry it will all be forgotten. And if it's totally forgotten, if one day nobody remembers past sacrifices and joys, the stories and the tragedies and the heroic and beautiful moments, if it's totally forgotten, then it will just be swallowed up by nothingness. It'll be annihilated like it never happened. So older people, in desperation, repeat the same stories over and over. They scrapbook and they try to remind people. They try to save the past, keep it alive, rescue it from oblivion. Because it's so sad that all that history, all that goodness, all that beauty could be lost forever. And the thing is, if there is no God and no heaven, all the past will be lost forever. One day the world will end Human life will be over, and there will be no one left to remember anything. And then it will be like the entire human thing, the triumphs, the trials, the drama of every person, every family, and every story. It'll be just like none of it ever happened. Everybody knows that if there is no God and no heaven, then we have no future. But actually... If there isn't a God, and if there isn't a heaven, then our past is also doomed to oblivion. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. But hope knows that there is a heaven, and that God not only has an unimaginably glorious future for us, he also preserves the full celebration of the past. One of the things that the church teaches that you might not be aware of about heaven is that everyone who goes there will be able to see and appreciate all the details of human history. We'll be able to relive all the good times. We'll also be able to appreciate all the good that God was accomplishing in the midst of the hardest times. So we don't have to worry obsessively about clinging to the past or preserving it. The home video collection in heaven is complete. We'll be able to enjoy it for eternity. The important thing now is to focus on getting to heaven. Once we're there, we can delight in the beauty of the past as we experience an endless future of perfect happiness. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. St. Michael, the archangel, defend, defend us in battle. battle. Be our, our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. devil. May God, God rebuke him, we humbly pray. pray. And do, do thou, O Prince, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by, by the power of God, God cast into hell Satan, Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl throughout the world, the world seeking the ruin of souls. souls. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Teresa, I noticed you kind of cocked one of your eyes about this last point that one of the things that the church teaches us about heaven is that everyone who goes there will be able to see and appreciate all the details of human history, will be able to relive all the good times. I was actually kind of laughing at something in that moment. Why? You, you said something about the home video collection will yeah. be complete. Yeah. And the only home video that we have that I remember is just like a 10 minute video of Grace eating green beans. And I was like, I don't need that to be completed. 10 minutes was too many. It's just her sitting there in her like uh, high chair eating green beans. I'm like, great. Eternity is going to be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> No, but more more seriously, I did have I did have more other than that specific part. I was really interested by closer to like the first or second point, I can't remember where talking about the desire to relive these memories and have them now, but really I was reflecting upon that as a sort of very desirable but unsatisfying meal. That right now we very much want to live in the past and we want to relive the good times and we want to hold on to them and we have this great hunger that nostalgia for the past but at the end of the day we can't have perfect happiness on earth even in those moments even in the good times you weren't perfectly happy you weren't perfectly happy you might look back and believe that you were but you really weren't and the level of happiness that you have now looking back on it and living in the past and trying to hold on to it is even less than that. So you're just desiring more and more to be satisfied by something that is less satisfying every single time, but you think you're being satisfied. So you keep going back to that meal and you're starving. This is very interesting. I wasn't thinking about this, but I wonder if when we look back at the past, because we're out of the moment, mm -hmm. We can see the good and we delight in it. Yeah. But we kind of missed it in the moment. Mm -hmm. Oh, absolutely. But when we spend our time looking back in the past and trying to delight in that moment, we're missing the delight in this mm -hmm. moment. There is there is a good in reflecting on the past and seeing that there is good there that you didn't recognize. But I think there's a very stark line that we, we can see pretty visibly when we're doing it, that you're just going back because you're not happy now and you're looking for that versus, oh, I really appreciate that now and I'm grateful, but then you can set it aside. So then it seems to me the antidote is learning to find the good and delight in 
the present moment. Mm -hmm. There's so much to delight in in each moment. Yeah. And it, this life is good and there is much to delight mm -hmm. in. What I'm thinking is that because now my temptation is not to live in the past. My temptation is to live in the future. Uh, I don't, I don't do that at all. Well, we're, we're nice. We're two nice bookends. We both, <laughs> you're the past, I'm the future uh -huh. and neither of us are living where we should. Yep, absolutely. And in both cases, we're missing all the delight in the now. Yes. We should be present to the present of mm -hmm. the present moment. But I think the fear is that there's not, maybe you perceive that right now there's not as much to delight in. Again, if you're thinking of it as the metaphor of food, you might think that there's only like a morsel to eat right now, but it is objectively going to be more satisfying, even if it is as tiny as you think, even if it's just a crumb left behind to eat, it's going to be more satisfying than the thought of food. and. There will be more food if you start delighting in right now, if you start actually consuming the present. Excellent phrase. Consume the present. That's a good, that's actually a good resolution flowing from this meditation. Consume the present. But I think the only way to live in the present moment is, is to abandon yourself to divine providence. Mm -hmm. You got to abandon the past, surrender the past to God. You have to surrender the future to God because you can't yeah. control either. As Dropkick Murphys once said, I can't predict the future. I don't care about the past. <laughs> Not sure if he's a saint, but that's a good quote. Uh, I, th I don't think they're dead yet. Also, I, I feel can't make any judgments. I don't really know if that's their thing, though. <laughs> if we, but we can practice living in the present moment. I find mm -hmm. that for me, because I'm always rushing ahead of living in the future, for me, I have to really slow myself down. Mm -hmm. I have to slow down and be in this moment. Now you have the opposite problem. Your, your tendency is to look back. So what do you need to do? It's a good question. I wish I knew. I mean, let me think for a second. What do I need to do to live in the present and not the past? Should I play some elevator music while you're... Uh-huh. Mm, I don't think it's that complicated. It's just... I'm very aware when I'm pulled back by memories and recollection and comparing now to the past. So as long as I turn off that channel, I can start watching what's actually on live TV. Well, the, the, you just said it. Practice watching what's now. Mm -hmm. For both of us. We be present now mm -hmm. because there is much to delight in. Yeah, one I would say is actually gratitude. That's very, very helpful with living in the present, especially if you're like me and you're living in the past and nostalgia is very tempting. Look at what you have right now because you're probably not aware of what you have now and what you're going to lose later and look back on nostalgically. Isn't that ironic? It's really ironic. Yeah. But you've just hit it. If we would practice gratitude now, gratitude requires that we become aware of the good. Mm -hmm. Once we become aware of it, it helps us live with it now. Yeah. Because if we're comparing our lives right now to our future and our past, the future and the past are always going to win because we think we, we know the pros and cons there. It's, it's like if you're you're watching a team play a sport, if you've I've only really seen the Bruins play and I only focus on that. So, yeah, I can tell you how good each player is, what their strengths are. If you ask me about any other team, though, I'm going to be like, yeah, they're probably not as good as the Bruins because I can tell you everything about the Bruins. I know everything about it. So if you're constantly reflecting on the future and the past, yeah, they're going to seem really, really good. But you don't know the strengths of the present because you're not really thinking about it. Yeah. Analyze your team. <laughs> what did you say? Consume the moment? Consume the present. Consume the present. <laughs> I like that. Well, let's be apostles of friendship, good conversation, and the rosary. Share this with others.
If you like this, join us on our app. You'll find the link below.